can't. I can't do it. Lacey, it's gonna be okay. You've done this before. But what if something goes wrong? I don't want to die. You're not gonna die. You've been in surgery tons of times before. But it only takes one thing to go wrong. <laughs> Can you finish that one up, please? Will she be okay? For now. Have they decided to go through with... Helene won't let them back down. Lacey's far too important to her. It's kind of a big decision, though, don't you think? Alexander, the science we're perfecting here is bigger than all of us. We have to do everything we can to ensure our survival. And don't let your feelings get in the way. Progress. You can see her soon? Yes, but we need to be talking about uh, how we're going to be proceeding soon. Because so it's possible. There, she, uh, as I say, she should be waking up in just a few moments. So why don't you just go right ahead? Okay. Lay down. lay down. Mom, I'm fine. I have to lay down, Lacey. How are you feeling? Fine. Can I get you anything to eat? No, I'm good. Are you tired? I just want to go home.
possibly want. All we ask is that you don't ask any questions. It's for your own good. You can't force me to do this. Lacey. Marie is. I am 18 years old. If you won't tell me what's going on, Dr. Church will. Dr. Church. Lacey, your disease is incredibly difficult. The only way we can allow someone with your type of Neiman Pick disease to live past the age of 15 is to use critical organs. Organs that can only be harvested from someone who's not living. But that's illegal. Lacey, do you know what germline engineering is? Uh, germline engineering is a process taking DNA from an embryo and changing it. So you changed me to, to get rid of the disease? Not you. You were already born when you were dying. We designed another person, the perfect donor, both while she's alive and when the time comes, dead. Marie. When will the time come? Tonight. I don't think I can go through this. This is another girl's life I'm taking. Lacey. She doesn't have a life. That womb is the only life she's ever had. We won't force you to do anything you don't want to do. I, I don't want to die. Then Marie has to. I want to talk to her. Alone. I'm sure she'll decide against it. Hi, Marie. I'm Lacey. Don't let him kill me, Lacey. What about me? Am I just supposed to die? My whole life I've given you my blood, a piece of my lung, my kidney. Don't make me give up my life too! Dr. Church won't let you go! What kind of a life will you live in here? I have a chance to live a real life. How would you live with the guilt, knowing that you've taken another girl's life? How would you? You can't go through with this! Lacey, please! Alexander! <laughs> Decided against the surgery. 